Hey guys, this is your girl Duchess coming to you with a quick video. I thought that I would share a, um, a sewing tip with you all because I am sewing um, some stretch leather, I'm sorry, some stretch faux leather, stretch vinyl, whatever you choose to call it. Now with this type of fabric, whether it's leather or vinyl, it usually gets stuck in a standard J foot. And I don't know if you can see that, but this is a standard J foot. So I just wanted to show you all really quickly on why you cannot use the standard uh, sewing foot to sew this type of material and what you can do to, um, what you can do to sew your fabric better. So let me show you this. This is a standard J foot and look what happens. My fabric isn't going anywhere. I mean, I'm sorry, my needle isn't going anywhere. And usually when you sew leather, for sure leather, like you can't make any mistakes because it'll show up on the fabric. But it just so happens that I am doing gathering stitches for a sleeve. So this is a sleeve for one of my projects. So I'm going to stop the camera and I'm going to switch um, my sewing foot and I'm going to come back and tell you what foot I'm using and and let you see the difference okay I am back with my new sewing foot this foot is called the non-stick foot or the Teflon foot and this is desi designed to sew all of the fabrics that I mentioned previously so let's uh, let's see the difference and you see that it goes right through guys I am back with my third and final uh, sewing foot this is called the roller foot and it's self explanatory two small rollers in the rear and one large roller in the front and you can see how it's going through I have it on the slowest setting so that I can finish doing my gathers I did the first basting stitches with uh, the non-stick slash Teflon foot and now I'm doing this with the roller foot and you can see how it just g glides through so that when I do my gathers with this uh, faux leather, faux stretch leather, I won't have any problems. This is Duchess signing off. Have a great day.